something a little different this week. Lots of people stuck in their homes. Not able to go to work. Quarantine for whatever reason. Well, I guess we all know the reason. Well, it's a good time to hopefully get outside if you can. Maybe do a little gardening. That's what I've got in mind for this video. Just a way to stay active. A way to get outside and get some fresh air. So I'm taking some really pretty figured maple. And I'm going to make some handles for these garden tools. If you follow me on Facebook, you'll know what I'm about to reference, and that's the last uh, entry that I made. And it was regarding a comment that Dr. David Jeremiah said during one of his sermons regarding the coronavirus and how we should deal with it. And he pointed out that it takes as much energy to pray as it does to worry. One of those things leads to peace, and one leads to panic. And we have to make our own decisions on what we want to do there. For me, I'm choosing to pray. I'm choosing to rest on my faith in the Lord Jesus Christ as my personal Savior and we may not understand why everything happens so just stay calm make good sensible decisions You know, follow the guidance of the of the medical professionals when it comes to hand washing and face touching and social distancing and so on. But apply common sense. A lot of us react to what we hear, and, and uh, I guess the trend is to go out and buy as much toilet paper as you can, which <laughs> I, uh, I don't get that one, but. Uh, It just makes the point. It's panic. It's people panicking. Just get what you need. Consider what others need as well. And just stay calm. As best you can. And pray. Pray for our leaders to have wisdom, to make the right decisions. Pray for everybody working on the front lines, from the hospitals to the grocery stores. Because you know those retail workers, they're out there getting some for us. I sure appreciate them. The UPS workers. Dave, I sure appreciate you, brother. People working the post office. Police. Firefighters. EMS. Even the people still working in the restaurants. Cooking food, even if it's for curbside takeout service. 
pray for all these people that are still working for the public in, in so many different capacities. Pray for their safety and their protection. Pray for your families. For all of you. Anybody around the world listening to this. Anybody around the world not. This is a time to come together as a people, as a, as a human race. Not a time to pull apart. It's not a time for blame, for partisan politics. There's just no place for it right now. Just stay calm and carry on. Thanks, everybody. Okay, get ready for some news. This is an unannounced giveaway. That's right, I'm giving away all three of these garden tools to one lucky subscriber. Okay, hit that pause button and read these rules. You gotta subscribe. Use the word Semperfy in a comment to this video and do it before 3 p.m. Eastern Time on March 26th. That's next Thursday. I'm going to use a random comment picker to select a winner, and I'll do that and announce the winner on March 27th in that video. And whoever wins, you got to contact me via email. Find my email under the About tab on my YouTube page. But you have to contact me by April 2nd by 3 p.m., or I'll choose somebody else, an alternate. Once the winner contacts me through email, in a return email, I will send follow-on instructions on what to do to verify that they are indeed the winner. This contest is open worldwide. I will ship to wherever it is the winner is from. The only caveat to that is that uh, I'm sure there's a lot of restrictions involved right now just to the uh, current pandemic situation. If that's the case, I'll just hold it until things open up. Also, just for your information, if you're one of the people still watching this video at this point, the average views for my videos are about half or a little bit less than half of the actual video time. In other words, more than 50% of the people watching these videos only watch the first couple minutes and then they skip to the end. They don't see anything in between. So, by doing it this way, 
hopefully I'm only talking to my most loyal watchers, viewers, subscribers. Best of luck to you. Overall, I'm pretty happy with how these turned out. The wood is beautiful. It's got a lot of figure in it. I, I did a pretty good job matching up these handles. Uh, you can tell they're a set, I'll say that much. And that tool right there, it dried a little bit, uh, little bit off to the side. So there's a, a slight uh, gap that's filled with resin, so it's no, no big deal. But uh, these are all cast aluminum. They're really light and wieldy, but they're also very strong. Thanks for watching. God bless and Semper Fi.